Hi everyone, let's go ahead and see how you can install Kiwana. Then I'll be also showing you how you can connect your Kiwana with the Elasticsearch. You need to open here elastic.co forward slash Kiwana. So we are here on Kiwana page. On Kiwana page, you need to click on download Kiwana. Once you click on this download Kiwana, it will lead you to download Kiwana. Here you need to select your platform. So it's Linux platform is selected. Then you need to say it here. You, you need to click it. Uh, click opt get. Once you click on opt get, it will lead you to here install from opt repository. All right. So before installing it from the opt repository, you need to install a signing key as well. So this is signing key. Moreover, this particular link is given in video description. You can, you can directly come to this documentation from a video description itself. We will be using also Elasticsearch. So Elasticsearch, I have already shown it in my previous video. You can visit my channel KGP Talkie. On that, I have made a video how to install and configure Elasticsearch 8 on Ubuntu. So, and the link of this particular video is also given in video description. You can see this particular video to see how you can install Elasticsearch. Thereafter, how to install Kiwana, we are going to see in this video. All right. So basically, you need to copy this whole thing. You can simply double click. Uh, you can simply triple click here. So after doing triple click quickly, this everything will get selected. Then just copy this whole thing, open terminal. I'm just going to open here terminal and then I'm going to just right click here this paste. Maybe your terminal open here in home directory somewhere like this. You just right click and paste it here. I'm going to give here password. All right. So it says that do you want to overwrite the file? I want to overwrite this file. Thereafter, it's pretty much simple. You need to just install Kibana from this opt repository. You just simply copy this whole thing. Although we have done this in previous lecture where we installed Elasticsearch, I'm just going to do it one more time here. Just paste it here. This whole thing is done there. Once that is done, then you can copy this whole thing. Just uh, click it here uh, three times and then copy this whole thing from here. After doing that, right click and paste it here. Now you can see it here. You have got your uh, elastic search there. All right. Uh, I mean to say that from the elastic search, you also, uh, uh, you, you also got your signing key for the Kibana as well. Once all these things are done, then you need to just install the Kibana. If you have already done for elastic search, then you do not need to do these three steps. You can skip all these three steps. You can directly install Kiwana from here itself. You just right click and copy it from here and then just simply paste it here. So it's going to install Kiwana here. First it will update. Thereafter it will upgrade and then it will install here Kiwana. It has started installing the Kiwana. Once Kiwana is installed, then you need to just scroll it down. Here are the another method to install Kibana, which we don't need in any way. Then it says that you can start, you can start elastic search and then generate the enrollment token for Kibana. We do not need this process because previously, if you remember, we had started our elastic search without any password there. So if you have a password, then you need this particular, uh, the particular process. Otherwise, you can simply skip this process because we have already disabled the password in elastic search through the configuration. So this whole thing you can skip. You need to come to run Kibana with system MD. Once your Kibana is installed, then you can, you, you need to run these four steps here. So your Kibana is installed here. Let's go ahead and run these four process here. So I'm just going to copy these two process in one go. And then I'm going to just paste it here. Once I paste it here, these two process is successfully executed. Thereafter, I'm just going to start Kibana service from here. All right. So I just start the Kibana service here. It's going to start the Kibana service. 
and if you if you have not running your elastic services you can simply use these command to run your elastic service or you can just check your elastic service if it is running i'm just gonna open it here a new terminal and then i'm just gonna check the status here it says that it needs the password and it says that my elastic search service is running here so to work with the kiwana you need to have elastic search so you should make sure that your elastic search is running in good condition in green active condition that is running here now let's go ahead and check our kiwana status so what i do here i just write here system control kiwana status and it says that our kiwana has also started Congratulations, you have successfully installed the Kiwana and we have already installed Elasticsearch. Let's go ahead and check if you can access Kiwana. You, to, to access Kiwana, you can simply write here localhost and then 9200. So this 9200 is for Elasticsearch. This is Elasticsearch port. If you want to access Kiwana, you need to provide here 5601. This is default port for a kibana you just simply write here localhost 5601 now you can see there your kibana has started so the first time it says that welcome to elastic and if you want to start kibana you may need to include some data although i'm just gonna say that explore on my way i'm my own way now i see that my kibana has already started here so my kibana is also connected with elastic search do remember if elastic search is not running then the kibana will not run here so if kibana is running that means it has already found their elastic search so to access elastic search uh, development window you can simply uh, you know uh, scroll it down here you see you need to come to this dev tool once you click on dev tool you would be seeing here a console in this console you can simply this copy this whole thing and just see that what are the things available here all right so just i copy this whole thing and then i paste it here what i had here i'm just gonna you know paste it here and then i'm just gonna run it here so once i run it it says that there is no data available because in any way i have not indexed any data on my elastic search as of now so obviously there would not be any data here all right so that's how you can install elastic search and how you can install kibana and we have seen how to integrate this kibana with the elastic search thank you so much for watching this video please watch next video where we will where we will uh, uh, go through the detailed description of the kibana a detailed tutorial on Kibana and Elasticsearch.